Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Okay. Oh. How are you? Hey y'all, so it's currently, I don't know what date it is. Um, it's two in the morning and my water broke. I woke up to a gush of water in bed. And then now I'm literally, yeah, it's real because I'm literally sitting in water and I'm starting to have contractions. We have to go to the gas station and then we'll be heading to the hospital, which is eight minutes away. My parents are on the way. So they can be with Chloe. But yeah, y'all, it's surreal. I believe it is April 8th, not April 8th, July 8th. And baby boy wanted to come tonight, so, or tomorrow. But my water broke, so. I'm about to be pushing out a baby within the next few hours. And now I just have to prepare myself mentally for that. So I will check in with you guys once I get to the hospital. Hey guys, it's currently, what time is it? 4.33. Yeah, I got my epidural. I wasn't able to really record at all. The nurse was, has been in here the whole time. But basically, I did rupture, so. And I started to show like bloody show. I started to show that it was a lot of blood. Not really blood, but like, yeah, I'm not explaining. It. And then they admitted me and I was 3.5. I can still kind of feel my contractions. Not that much, but they're starting to wear off. Well, the doctor, um, the nurse went to go get the labor items. Cause she said the baby's heart rate is um, going down. So that could mean that he's moving down lower and we could be getting ready to push very soon. So hopefully the epidural just sets in completely by then. But yeah, epidural pain wasn't bad at all. I think it's because I prayed right before and I've been praying up to now, so. Hmm? What time? I think he's gonna be here by like 7 a.m. Sorry, I lost my train of thought. Sure. Okay, y'all, so. <laughs> I was supposed to, it was 2 in the morning. Hmm? I was supposed to, but it's like 4 in the morning. Y'all, yeah. he's telling me to go on TikTok Live. I might. Anyways, y'all, so. I forgot my camera at home, unfortunately. But the nurse went to go get a peanut ball so it can open up my pelvis a little bit more. You get baby to move down. I'm tired. I might take a little nap if I can. I'm supposed to get checked in like another hour. Well, my bottom half and my stomach's numb, y'all. I can't feel my stomach skin. I really, I kind of can't. It kind of feels weird. But the monitor's just been there. Everything's normal. Super excited. But like I was saying, I think he's going to be here at like 
7.30 a.m. Your bills, what time? What time? No, what time do you think he will be here? Definitely in the morning. 8. 8 a.m.? Okay. Yeah. Alright, okay, I'm getting the shivers from the epidural, but I'm going to check in with you guys once I get checked. Or once the peanut ball gets here. Y'all, date is 7 in the morning. And I'm at a six. And they told me they basically put a catheter in, emptied my bladder, and said that he should come down now because he was high up. So hopefully things progress quickly. They have me in an extreme side laying position. So I have the peanut ball right here. Peanut ball. And my leg is thrown over. So hopefully this helps me finish dilating. Yeah, super excited. Um, I'm gonna try to get you guys to set up the camera so we can get the pushing part. But yeah, I just pray that everything goes smooth. Thank God for a smooth labor so far. And yeah, I'll talk to you guys soon. I realized I didn't give y'all a tour. But the bathroom's right there. Baby's rest in it. And then like their closet. Um, a bed there. My mom's laying on it. Mini fridge. Balcony. Another chair to go sleep in. Then the bed that I'll deliver in. Baby boy's bed. And then the monitors. And that's the truth. I can see people walking through the glass over there and know that they're coming over here. I'm nervous, y'all. Yeah. Chloe, look. Who that? Who's that, Chloe?
guys. Baby Blue is about to get his bath. Chloe's here. Look, no, no. You see me? No. Okay. But they're setting it up for him. Getting the heated lights. <laughs> Well, that's a good one. That's Try the other one. Oh. I'll do a couple too. Okay. Just in case. Then. But I still go and make the blocks for you, know. Treat you like you number one, I top 10, you know.